Hi, my name is Michael Trout, and I'm going to basically give a talk on the Lean Startup and what it means to me. Now, I was first introduced to the Lean Startup in um, around August of 2009, and it was just getting going. If you look at Wikipedia based on the information, you know, it says it was launched um, in, um, well, here it doesn't talk about it for some reason, but it was launched in 2008. If you look at his his you know his his uh taught in his right here since 2000 he's been blogging and so on so you could actually say that um you know he was you know he really started to um uh kind of promote the idea and a little bit about eric reese's you know he was a developer on a startup he was a coder he wrote code you know and ultimately he saw a lot of his code basically get trashed and he said you know why is this and you know why are startups failing and the simple fact is that over 99 percent of startups fail and here's Dave McClure and he, he did this you know this slideshow in October uh, of last year um, talking about you know don't do a startup because you're just gonna fail which is really true if you think about it if you have a 99 percent chance of failure rate and what attracted me to the whole Dave McClure or you know the lean startup was the fact that if you listen to this presentation all right at, at the web 2.0 expo his whole premise is startups should not fail yet his best his buddy Dave you know Dave McClure here is saying you will fail so I'm an idealist and I was immediately attracted to Eric Ries and his premise however since you know, kind of being involved and in, in reading and looking into it. What I realize, what, what Eric Reese is all about, is he's all about selling his book. And ultimately, he is an author who wrote this book, and he's just trying to sell copies of his book. That's what he is. I mean, it's, and the simple fact is, is that the lean startup has the same failure rate, even though he came up with this premise based on Toyota practices, lean manufacturing, yada, yada, yada. The simple fact is startups still fail. Pre-seed startups still have a 99% chance of becoming an early stage startup. And a pre-seed startup obviously is pre-seed, meaning pre-money, and early stage, meaning you've gotten your private placement, uh, your pre-IPO, your pre-public, right? But you've gotten significant uh, investment behind you in order to give you the sort of traction that you need to uh, scale up okay because startups and if you if you there's something else out there called the startup Geno product says the, the reason why startups fail is they failed to scale at the right time and yada 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 so my whole point is you know the lean startup is a bunch of crap um, it hasn't changed anything except for sold a bunch of books um, you know Dave McClure even though I think he's a he's a jackass, I, I call him Dave Fucking McClure because every other word out of his mouth is fucking. And and I've actually gone a little bit more Dave McClurish over the years, um, and more out there because you know I look at him as a mentor, even though he's never responded to one single email that I've sent out to to him. Um, and he sits as part of the Angel Gate. He's one of the Angel Gate. Um, uh, uh, angel investors from Silicon Valley, and. And he's right on when he, you know, this is kind of tongue in cheek slide presentation, but this slide presentation is right on. If you do a startup, you have a 99.9% .9 chance of failure from a pre seed to early stage. He doesn't say that, but that's the simple fact. Um, if you follow the lean startup, if you read about it, if you buy the book, it's not going to help you. Why? Because the systemic problems of the startup are still there. Now, what's the solution? Well, I'll tell you, I believe I have a solution. Um, you know, I believe that the FoundUp, which is an open collaborative framework, it's free um, for folks to participate, to join with us, to use our C Corp, to be part of what we're doing globally. I believe that we can upset Silicon Valley. I believe we can upset the startup. The FoundUp is a collaborative vehicle. The startup is an institutional closed vehicle. So open is always going to, you know, beat up closed. And we're here trying to you know, pioneer a new way of launching companies using a collaborative framework. So you can go to foundups.org, you could go to foundupsblog.com, read up about what we're doing, connect with me. I will respond to emails. I will respond to phone calls. My name is Michael Trout. I appreciate you listening. Thank you very much.